Scroll to row allows you to click on a link, such as menu or button, and have it scroll down automatically to a section it's anchored to. This is especially useful for single page layouts as it efficiently guides the viewer through the web page and towards the needed information. For this video tutorial, we're going to look at how to set up a scroll to row anchor when using it for a single page menu. To do this, what you'll first need to do is set up the anchors on a single page layout. For this example, I've set up this page with four rows. I've got a welcome, about, events, and finally, a call to action row. Then, what I'm going to do is now add the anchors. To do this, I'm going to click on the row options icon here. It'll open the row options light box and on the row anchor input field, I'm going to input the row anchors. As this is my welcome row, I'm going to input welcome. Then on the next row, I'm going to input about. Next will be events. And for the last call to action row, I'm going to input register. Then I'm going to click done, save, and then turn off the builder. Now what I'm going to do is I'm going to go to my dashboard and go to the menu section. Here we can create a new menu for a single page layout. To do this, Click on the Create a New Menu link. Then, input the menu name. After doing this, go to the Custom Links dropdown. On the URL input field, input the row anchor with a number key in front. For the link text, add any text that you'd like. Then click Add to Menu. Now do the same thing for all the other rows. Once you are done, click on the Save Menu button. Now all we have to do is go back to the page that we created. Scroll down to the Themify Custom panel and click on the Page Options tab. And then on the Custom Menu drop-down, select the new menu we just created. And then click Update. And that's it! Now when you go to the front end, You'll see the new menu that you've set up, and when you click on the certain link, it'll scroll down to that particular section. You can also do this on any text link or button module, so that when users click it, it'll anchor to a certain row. Let's use these two buttons for example. Let's first turn the builder back on. Then edit the learn more button link. I want to anchor it to the about section. So I'm going to put on the link input field, the anchor about. And for the registration, I wanted to anchor on my call to action row at the bottom. So I'll just put the anchor register. And that's it. Now I'm going to click done and then save. Then, when I close the builder and click on the two buttons, it'll anchor to the rows I've set.